that was a turn of events. Um, well, if you guys haven't seen the uh, most, not the most recent video, but one of our recent videos on the channel, you guys will know that we talked about our time in the shop and how much time we spent in the shop. And, uh, well, they didn't like that. <laughs> uh, essentially, um, it's down right now just because I don't want to get in any more trouble than I've already got myself into. But, uh, basically, we talked about how much time we spent in the shop and how devoted I was to this place. Essentially saying the fact that we lived here. And that didn't go so well with the uh, people who manage this place. Um, even though I have my own residence, you know, I have multiple people to vouch for that, um, that doesn't matter. Uh, they took it upon themselves to kick me out of this shop, even though that all I do here is this kind of stuff. Well, when those kind of people say you have to be out, well, you don't really get a choice and you have to be out. So that's where we're at right now. I decided to come here, update you guys about kind of what's going on uh, as far as the shop goes and uh, take this opportunity to say that we got kicked out and that most likely we won't be shooting videos here anymore and I have about 20 some odd days to take all of this, all the lift and cars and all the tools and all that completely out of here. So uh, I wanted to take this opportunity to say that uh, for those of you who have been following my channel all along, you guys know that we've been recording in so many different places and I've never really been one to be negative. Oh Jesus, did you fart? <laughs> I've never really been one to be negative and we kind of make do with what we got, but this, uh, this shop was a huge stepping stone for this channel and it made me realize how much I love what I do. And it's unfortunate when you have roadblocks like this, um, you know, come in line with uh, your goals and aspirations. And like I said, I wanted to take this opportunity to show you guys that Adversity will happen, no matter what. No matter how much you love something, no matter how much uh, you try to be perfect, um, obstacles are gonna fall in line with you and your goals and your aspirations. And it's up to you and your perspective on what kind of decisions and how you act based upon those situations that fall on your lap or you come across with uh, through your journey and figuring out what you want to do. Now, I know it's kind of hard to shed a positive light on something so negative as basically getting evicted from my shop, but uh, I just want to sit here and be open with you guys and really show you guys how vulnerable uh, I can be and let you guys know that I'm not stopping uh, just for the fact that we don't have the shop anymore. It's very unfortunate. We painted this whole place. We got this whole entire place set up, ready to be able to make content. I just signed the lease to my brand new house. I finally have a place of my own to separate my work and my lifestyle. And uh, you know, right when you think everything's gonna go good, you know, the world takes something away from you. It really comes down to how you handle yourself in those kind of situations. You know, this shop wasn't gonna guarantee success through my YouTube channel. It comes down to me and my work ethic and my consistency and my passion that I have. Losing this place as hard as it is, um, it's really a wake up call to let, let me know that uh, life is real and that we're vulnerable. And no matter how, uh, how good you think you have it, things can be taken from you very quickly. And you have to adapt based on how those things happen. So really today's video is letting you guys know that no matter what adversity you guys fall through in your life, uh, you know, something like having a car channel and completely losing my shop is one of the hardest things that I've had to accept uh, within the past couple of years. And, you know, I didn't want to keep you guys out of the loop. And if, you know, my goal is to be honest and open and transparent with this channel. Um, this is a part of my life that you guys have to see, that you guys get to 
this is the part of my life that I want you guys to see because uh, based on how we come back from this is gonna justify how much I actually care about this channel and how bad I really want it. And uh, this is to show you guys that I'm serious and that we're not stopping. So, we're gonna start cleaning up. I already got Chris packing up a bunch of uh, scrap metal that we have to jump off, uh, that we have to drop off before we start cleaning up everything. This sucks. Yeah, it's not gonna be fun. But, um, we're still here. We're still making videos while we can, so. I really do appreciate everyone who supports this channel and anyone who's still watching this video. Um, I want you guys to know that you guys are a huge driver in my life and that providing content and providing value and being able to help you guys and talk to you guys and see you guys support me is, um, it's, it's a huge factor in my life and it's, it's, it's definitely a, a part of what keeps me going every single day. So, I'd like to thank you guys, and I'd like to remind you that any sort of adversity that you guys face in your life, you can overcome it. You have to adapt, and you just gotta keep pushing through, especially if it's something you love to do. You don't give up. So, this is gonna be a first-hand view of that, and, uh, you know, whether you guys are watching this video later, or you guys are watching this uh, currently, um, right here is kind of a timestamp to show you guys that if you don't give up, 